How's it going guys? Brian here. Today we're going to be talking about Michael B. Jordan's style, what makes it so iconic, and if there's anything that we could take from it so we can look just as good as he does. So if that's something that you guys are into, then make sure to stick around. If you guys don't already know, my name is Brian and I make fashion YouTube related content. So if looking good and feeling good is something that you guys are into, then make sure to subscribe. But with that, let's get straight into it. So the first thing that we're going to talk about when it comes to Michael B. Jordan's style is going to be the type of outerwear that he wears, starting with his denim jacket. Now honestly, the denim jacket that he wears is a good example of how guys should start rocking denim jackets. That's because the way that it fits, the arms are loose, so it's not like he's using his muscles to make the jacket look good, but when it comes to the length, it sits above his waist, and that's what gives it a more military aesthetic and makes it look like if it's actually tailored for him. I think that when it comes to us guys, we have this common mistake of when we wear jackets, we kind of think of it as almost like a long sleeve or a t-shirt. So with the lengths, we make it end all the way where our pockets are. But I think that while this is fine, it's not always the way we should go. Sometimes we should experiment with jackets that end above the waist. And that's going to make the jacket look like if it's more expensive and tailored to you. Another thing you guys are going to be noticing is that he likes to experiment with two different types of materials when it comes to his jacket. So when it comes to this denim jacket, for example, he has a Sherpa lined collar denim jacket. And what this does is honestly, it makes it look a lot more unique from all the other denim jackets that you see out there. And when it comes to the winter months, it's a good transitional piece and it's going to keep him warm. Also, you can see that he keeps this similar type of idea of combining two different materials when it comes to his bomber jacket. The bomber jacket that he's wearing right here, you can see how he actually has leather sleeves, but then the body is made of a different material, which again goes to make his outfit look more complex without him having to put any actual thought. And because both materials are the same color, just different shades, it makes it look sleek and it doesn't look tacky. So honestly, this is something that you guys should be experimenting with when picking up jackets. Instead of getting something that's going to be one solid material, personally, I would go the route that he goes and I would be getting jackets that are going to be made out of multiple materials. That way your outfits can start having more personality and look more high end. When it comes to his flannels, he wears his flannels actually pretty loose and I think this is because he uses his flannels to make his wardrobe have more of a streetwear aesthetic. Whereas his denim jacket or even his bomber jackets looks more classic and more put together and timeless, his flannels is where he can really experiment and kind of show off the streetwear culture that he grew up in. Now the one thing that I want you guys to take from his actual wardrobe is going to be the way he rocks his sweaters. If you look at the crew neck that he's wearing in this picture, honestly this is how a crew neck should fit and I think it kind of shows the power of fit over a graphic design. This shirt doesn't have any graphic designs, it doesn't say Gucci, it doesn't have any labeling in it, but it looks freaking amazing in him and it looks like it's made of really high quality. And that's because it fits his body well and it makes it look high end because of that and shows off his physique. So if you're going to take anything from this video, make sure that when you're wearing crewnecks, you're wearing stuff that's also going to be very well fitted. Now this isn't to say that you shouldn't be wearing loose fitted crewnecks. I know that most of my crewnecks are loose fitting, but I think Michael B. Jordan just sets a reminder that fit is always king and it's always going to look the best. Now again, it doesn't mean that you always have to be wearing fitted clothes. That could get kind of boring, but you should have some crewnecks that fit well in your wardrobe. The next thing on the list is going to be the type of jeans he wears. So the type of jeans that Michael B. Jordan wears, honestly, it's not really super skinny jeans. It's jeans that are going to be more relaxed and are going to have slight stacks in the bottom of it. He also doesn't cuff his jeans and this is for good reason. The reason that he doesn't cuff his jeans and he doesn't wear super tight skinny jeans is because the sneakers he chooses to wear are typically high top sneakers and they can come off as a bit chunky. If he were to wear something that's way too skinny, all it's going to do is make it look like if his feet are ginormous and his legs are actually fragile. So instead he kind of marries the combination and keeps a similar aesthetic all throughout the bottom portion of his body if he does wants to dress it up he does wear a lot of leather type material when it comes to shoes so whether it's a leather chucka boot or just a leather dress shoe he typically plays around with this type of material so if you guys want to steal that aesthetic you could also look at my Sean Mendes video because we know that he loves to wear leather chucka boots as well and he makes it look great all right guys so before I leave I want to let you guys know that this isn't all he wears I'm not saying that everything in this video is going to be what's in his wardrobe this is more just the summary points of what's the foundation of his wardrobe based on a couple of pictures that I saw. All right guys, if you found this video informative, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And also follow me on Instagram at Men's Minute Fashion for more outfit inspiration. But with that, thank you for watching. Stay stylish and stay humble.